Hey guys, it's Jen here, and I found pretty something, something really pretty amazing that happened last Wednesday or Thursday. It was the 31st of July, and so, oh, it was Wednesday. Yep, there we go. See? Um, anyway, Facebook is going to enable their post to be embeddable. Now, what this means is that you're going to be able to go to people's posts, um, and it can be a personal profile or it can be a fan page, and you'll be able to go to that page and you're going to be able to take things that have been shared publicly and embed it on a website or your blog. And so, right now, the only people that have access to this are the only any the only companies I should say that have access to this are CNN, the Bleacher Report, Huffington Post, Mashable, and People. And it says that they're going to be rolling this out more widely in the coming weeks. So I'm really kind of excited about this. And one of the really cool things, as you'll see, is since it's in the CNN, we're on CNN's pages. This makes these embeddable posts interactable so or you can interact with these posts I should say uh, you can like the page from here you can like the com you know you can make a comment uh, you know you'll be able to do all those things you'll be able to click share all of those things and what that's going to do is for the most part keep people on your page and give them the option to do a little interacting of their own and so you'll be able to share things that are important to your audience or that you find cool and kind of fun like I found this cool and kind of fun and so how is this gonna work and I will show you real quickly how this is done the first thing we'll do is we'll go to my actual um, fan page and what, what would happen is you would come here and normally this says something like something, you know remove uh, report spam or hide delete post or whatever if it's you know you're from some it's something that shows up in your news feed however pretty soon there's also one of these things that's going to say embeddable and what you're going to do is be able to click on that link and embed that happen to be a little post and I wanted to show you this on my personal page you know you'll be able to go to your personal page you'll be able to click this and, and there'll be an embeddable post and one of the things that I want to show you is you're going to need to be able to, let me get to the view as real quick, uh, view as, and I'll show you, you'll have to have this little follow link. So anybody that you go to that has this little bitty follow link and whose messages are, as you can see here, public. What you'll be able to do then is is to take that post, click on it, and there will be the embed link. Uh, um, there will be an embed that you can click on, and it will show you how to link. Now, if you yourself want to be able to have people be able to embed your post, then what you're going to want to do is actually go over to the activities. You just click this and it'll say account settings you go over to your account settings and on this left hand side you have general security privacy timeline tagging blocking notifications mobile and right under mobile there is a little link that says followers if you click on followers and make sure that this is clicked that's what you need to do is click this right here and that will allow you to have followers on your Facebook profile and a follower is somebody who can come over it somebody that's interested in what you have to say but they don't want to shoot you a Facebook friend request uh, maybe they're in the same company as you and just want to see what you're doing maybe they just are really interested in what you have to say but you know they don't feel comfortable enough yet to reach out because they're they're not maybe an acquaintance but they just kinda like something you had to say so with that being said, I want to kind of show you how an embeddable little post like this works. And Twitter has actually had this set up for a while. So if you'll go over to Twitter or one of these other other places, um, you can click on, or if you go to Twitter, <laughs> not one of these other places. If you go to Twitter, you can go and click on a post that's your own. 
or somebody else's and click the embed tweet and what you'll get is this little bit of HTML that you can post into your actual uh, blog which will make things uh, clickable and then you know people will be able to follow they'll be able to favorite retweet or reply but by doing that you make your page more interactable and it also allows people to start to see who you're following what you're doing what you're learning and it makes it just makes your posts a little bit more fun so I wanted to share this little tidbit with you um, you know you can already do this with Twitter like I've just shown you uh, Facebook should be rolling out with it soon I really hope that you guys have an awesome day and I will talk to you uh, probably next week because today's Friday so have an awesome day and have an awesome weekend. Bye.